Hello, beautiful humans. Where am I supposed to be looking right there? Hi, hello. Okay, um, I'm really excited about this. It's something I've been planning and working on for a while. This is comfrey that I infused into olive oil, but first I extracted um, the dried and ground up plant material in 100 proof uh, vodka. You can use either vodka or Everclear and I couldn't find the Everclear so I got vodka. But anyway, six weeks this has been cooking up. I'm really excited. So today I'm going to be straining this through some cheesecloth and I will have like legit some super dank, very potent um, comfrey infused oil and calendula infused oil. These two plants are powerhouses in their own rights for all different types of deep tissue issues, if you will. And since I like to help people with body parts that sometimes get angry, stinky, dry, sweaty, and sore, I'm going to make something cool with this. Oh, yay. Sanitization complete. Ooh, man, that is hot and steamy. Those are the jars that I'm going to strain comfrey and calendula into. See, if you look at it this way, you can actually read the labels. Not like when I was showing you before, we <laughs> looked backwards. <laughs> um, okay, so one jar for each of those. I got my cheesecloth ready, and those have been uh, sanitized and dried. Let's go. Here at Zen Booty, we practice good hygiene. And when I say we, I mean me. Me. I mean me. I mean me. I practice good hygiene, because Zen Booty is literally just me. One up. And two. Hello. Okay, so I'm gonna just do several layers of cheesecloth in one of my freshly sanitized jars. I'm literally just gonna poke the cheesecloth right down into the jar, just like that. Next step. Dude. That is gonna be incredible. Okay, so pouring. <laughs> wow, that sounds real, real special. Mmm, smells like hay. But that stuff is going to be so magical and potent. But look, very, very, very dark dark rich color on this comfrey uh, infused oil that I am so excited to mix together with some other magical things. So now same thing with the calendula. Um, I like this cheesecloth but the comfrey, um, when I was straining through the comfrey, dude the cheesecloth literally busted a seam right in the side of it. So I don't know if I'll continue to use cheesecloth or not. I've heard really good things about tea towels, which also are very good with straining um, and just a little bit more, you know, or less likely, I should say, uh, to rip and, um, you know, cause issues like that. So I'm just putting the cheesecloth right in there. I'm not going to go as deep into the jar this time because that suction from the comfrey was... Uh, well, I mean, it sounded funny, but it caused me to pull up too quickly and some of the precious oil was going over the sides of the jar, so I lost a little bit. I don't want that to happen. So, I'm gonna hold my cheesecloth so it doesn't like, let's see, it's, it's about, you know, it's that far down into the jar and I wanna try to keep it there as much as I can. Um, so we're gonna start pouring calendula oil into Empty sanitized jar with cheesecloth. Here we go. Ooh, 
can you see that color? Oh, calendula. Okay. I'm gonna pour some more in there because we can because we can. Oh, it's getting chunky. Oh yeah. Okay, I've taken off my gloves because uh, the oils are now completely in their jars in their new homes and I can't touch anything really. So um, there's my calendula, very, very rich, um, kind of just orangey brown color on that one. Uh, but that's a very dank, very, very potent um, infused calendula oil. This one, look at that, look at that rich green, so nice, uh, comfrey. So I'm going to be making some really, really beautiful stuff with this. Um, we've got our deep tissue issue uh, relief balm coming with this stuff. And then I think I'm going to do uh, like a wound, open wounds. Um, there's a lot of really great stuff going in this, along with the calendula, which by itself has like amazing restorative um, properties for tissue and skin. Um, but I'm going to be adding some other really nice stuff in there for antimicrobial, antiviral. Can't make any claims it's going to cure anything, but um, if you want to do your research yourself or just freaking try it out, I'm pretty sure um, I have very, very thoughtfully um, curated all of the ingredients on this stuff to make it like maximum potential benefit. Because I love you and your bits and I really wanna help you, you, to feel comfortable in your skin no matter what is going on. Until next time when I will be adding the other magical ingredients into my respective comfrey and calendula infused oils uh, to create my next creations.